right hand there. That's good defense to block that punch. Oh, big knee! He's got a ton of finish here. This is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes. would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Bruce Lee, ladies and gentlemen, Bruce Epic Lee is ready to engage in again. All right, now let's get you our tail of the tape for this welterweight championship fight. All right, now for the official introductions, we go inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Championship of the world. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, presenting the challenger, the future, Ian Machado Gary. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner, presenting the reigning, defending, Undisputed UFC welterweight champion of the world, Bruce the Dragon Lee. Herb Dean, our third man in the fight. octagon for this one. All right, here is Bruce Lee getting ready for another UFC start as we begin round one. So fast, so quick so good at setting up striking angles, and it's hard to simulate the speed in training. I know the opponent has talked a lot about trying to find training partners to simulate Bruce Lee. Easier said than done. Bruce Lee trying to get off to a good start tonight. Oh, a nice straight punch there to his opponent, and he lands it just after catching the leg. So clearly, he is starting to find his timing, not just offensively, but defensively as well. Very good read there. Oh, roundhouse kick. Add that to his highlight reel. Nice combination by the champ. Looks as though that kick to the body got through. And that, that was the danger in the engagement there. Oh, another massive kick. Oh, flying knee to the head. So more output, at least in the early going. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. And he lands that side kick. Hook attempt now blocked, though, by Lee. Get out of there. Came of inches right there. Oh, it was a good night at that land. Leg kick now. Lee gets caught by that straight punch. Beautifully landed by the opposition. Certainly showing off some good hands here tonight. Lands a nice leg kick. And there he goes, lands another combination. His cardio is so good that, is, that it allows him to put forth this type of output and pace. When his opponent is done at two, he is stringing together four, five, six more different strikes. You don't do that without having fantastic cardio. Lee 
Ali gets tagged by that stiff jab. Defense not there for him thus far tonight. It's work. Nice head movement to slip the left hand. Lee gets tattooed by a solid uppercut there. Can't take too many more of those. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Back and forth we go. Just over two minutes to go in round one. Oh, nice kick. Well, defense doesn't necessarily win championships in MMA, but he's doing a nice job blocking these shots. He's not allowing his opponent to get any damage off of him by blocking all these attacks. Unable to connect with him. Oh, another nice combination there. Not sure if it was the three-piece and a soda or what it was, but he is in a flow state here. Oh, he... Picture-perfect shot there, DC, and one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is gonna be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. Oh, huge left. Oh. Oh, my goodness. Oh, nice straight left. Pretty good jab there by Gary. Beautiful job landing that head kick. Oh, head kick gets home. Don't want to take too many of those. Well, it didn't take him long to get a good read on his opponent. Another good series of kicks there. He thought the kicks would be the key tonight, and they sure have been. Forty-five seconds to go here in round one. Nice kick. These guys are going at it. Oh! Oh, he's got him hurt badly now. Oh, big left. He ate that kick. He took that whole kick, yep. That was lightning fast, that right in. That one was thrown to end the fight. Yep. <laughs> 15 seconds. Nice shot to the body there. Knows is bleeding now, so we'll see how he handles that adversity, but nothing ideal about it here in the middle of this fight. All right, there's the horn. The round is over, but not before he was cut on his nose from the strikes in that round. Back to the stool. Cut man is in. Should be able to shut that cut and prevent it from becoming an issue moving forward. But, of course, as soon as he gets struck in that next round, it could open back up. All right, the truck has produced some replays from that previous round. Perhaps we can even isolate the strike that opened up that cut on the bridge of his nose. It's nasty, and it's in a bad spot because the reality is when you can't breathe through your nose, you start to open your mouth, but the blood is dripping down into your mouth. Ready. How is he going to breathe Ready. in order to have a chance Ready. to win this fight? Second round underway. All right, next round is now underway. Hopefully the action continues at a high level. Pretty good first five minutes. Pretty good first five minutes. Both of them can really pick it up. Let's see who decides they're gonna lead the dance as we go forward. Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. Oh, big strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he looks to try to chase down that fist. Oh, yes, now we're going. Huge block there. Beautiful head kick lands. Beautiful strike there as he continues to attack that cut. Cut man's gonna have some work to do if we get to the stool between rounds. But that's why we got the best in the business. We got the best cut men in the business, and they are going to need him right now because this cut is getting worse, and it's only gonna continue to get worse because he has got a killer in front of him. Back and forth we go. Leg kick lands. The issue with that kick, as effective as it is, one gets checked, you have the Anderson Silva situation. Lee's blocking well now. Nice job to protect that already damaged nose as he raises the goal. Oh, a huge strike lands there, DC. He landed that massive shot. Now he needs to try to find the next shot, the follow-up shot, that will finish the fight. Oh! 
Oh, he lands a massive kick here. Big right hand. Do not back up. Let's go forward now. Oh, Just out. over three minutes to go. Well, he is at his kickboxing best tonight. Another nice, good series of kicks by him. There. I mean, the kicks are coming in bunches. Normally, it's the hands. Tonight, he's throwing kick after kick after kick. Well, he has really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive than we saw in round one. And now starting to find himself in the puck. Ian Machado Gary's nose is bleeding now. Yes, looks as though he got cut by one of those offerings from his opponent. Nice block. Lee circling towards the left side now. Nice body kick there. Just over two minutes now to go in round two. Well, it's been a wild fight thus far. Perhaps a contender for some bonus money at fight's end. These guys are going to have to dig deep. They're both hurt. They're both hurt. You expected it. You expected a close fight. You did not expect a war like this, though, where both guys, from the moment they said fight, went forward, got in each other's face, and just beat each other up. It's been tremendous. Well, I think I can smell the blood at this point in time. That canvas didn't look like that a few fights ago. Blood is flowing from that cut with every passing strike. Every strike. And it burns. John, it burns so bad. When you get cut like that, every time a shot lands, it just burns. So this guy needs to try to find a way to not take and limit the damage he's taken to this cut. Easier said than done, though. Oh, straight punch. Well, he has certainly kept the punch counters busy tonight. He's landed a ton of significant strikes and clearly is winning this fight tonight. He's winning this fight going away, and it's one of those rare instances where everything comes together. Starting to do some really significant damage. How about the accuracy to land right there? His opponent's wobble champ. He's hurt bad. He cannot take another shot like that. Take shot. All right, 45 seconds now to go in the round. End this fight. End it. Oh, nice. Nice. Whiffs on the elbow. 30 seconds to go in round two. Big punch land. Oh! You heard him real bad. Oh, nice job with his kicking game there. Seconds winding down in round two. Lee's eye starting to swell now. All right, that's the end of round number two. All right, so there's the end of the round. You see the blood trickling down as he makes his way back to the stool. Cut on the bridge of the nose, or so it appears from the strike in that round. Cut man getting right to work. All right, let us show you all that was done in terms of the damage in that previous round. He has got a huge gash on his cheek. I mean, there was that shot right there. That one landed and opened him up. What a nasty combination thrown by his opponent. But this cut now is another issue to deal with. He's got one of the best fighters in front of him, and he's dealing with this cut on the cheek. You ready to fight? Ready. Go All right, here we go with this third round of this championship fight. All right, so back-to-back -back entertaining rounds. We'll see how it goes in this round. We'll see which corner sort of maximized those 60 seconds on the stool. This is what happens when you get two very skilled, very evenly matched fighters coming together. Nobody has really taking a lead in this fight. Let's see who does it going into the next one. Doing work with the jab there. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Oh, huge connection by him there. He needs to get on his bicycle, John. He needs to get into space so that he doesn't get finished. Right hook to the head block. Well, clearly his leg is hurt, and now you see him starting to limp a little bit, Shane. Yeah, he's starting to limp from the leg damage. Oh, he is 
Josh Dunn trying to recover here. Oh, with authority, the body. Oh, nice job to slip off the center line there. His head movement has been a huge, huge factor defensively in this fight. You can never be a stationary target. So even if the feet aren't moving, you got to be ready to slip that head. Lee's able to land another strike right there, right on the previously damaged nose. No surprise to see the fighter continue to attack that part of the opposition. Unable to land the head kick there. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strength. Oh, one of the best head kicks you'll ever see. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Oh! Under three minutes now to go in round three. Clean punch right there. Well, his opponent seemed to be stunned to a significant extent, but was able to recover, and it's almost like he let him off the hook a Kind of let him off the hook. Back and forth we go. These two guys are trading huge shots. Keep your hands up. We have crossed the midpoint of this fight. Lee going for the leg kick. Nothing doing there. Oh, he's landed a high number of total strikes here in the latter stages of this fight. He's really picked up the pace and landing far more strikes than he did in previous rounds. Looking to set up that head kick. Oh, he's had a huge strike right there. I'm not sure how many more of these his opponent can take. Massive shot that he landed. Great job. Oh! Oh, that's big. Lee gets hit with that stiff jab there. You wonder if the offensive fighter is going to start to get frustrated here. Most, if not all, of these shots are getting blocked. They're getting blocked because he's fighting one of the best defensive fighters in the UFC. Nice job offensively as the strike lands clean. Big shot to the head. Well, now you see some visible damage on the side underneath the elbow. He told us he was going to invest in the body, and he hasn't missed a whole lot tonight. You didn't expect him to do it this effectively. He's done a fantastic job of following the game plan. Some of the best kicks in the game that you'll see right there. Oh, caught him with a head kick. That at least partially landed. Oh, my goodness. He got kicked in the head, and he's still standing. Back to the well with that right hand, it's no good. Both guys appeared to land there. Takedown defense is there. Well, champ, I don't see that well, but it's hard to miss the redness underneath that elbow. A lot of bodily investment from his opponent tonight. Yeah, it's an investment, John. It may not pay dividends right now, but the more you go there, the more damage you do eventually, it will show itself. Right now, it's starting to show. Oh, nice punishing kick to the body. I mean, the hand speed, just absurd. His opponent's chin held up. His opponent's chin held up, but you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. Get back out there and keep doing what you're doing. Put the pressure on him. Don't give him an opportunity. All right, let us now get you some replays of all the damage done in that previous round, including the strike that opened up the cut. Yeah, some nasty strikes landed over the course of that round, and it opened up a nasty cut. He has got to find a way to change some things defensively or that cut is just going to get worse and worse. And the worse it gets, the more he runs the risk of this fight getting stopped. You ready to fight? Ready. Go All on. right, here's round four. Fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. Oh! He's got to keep pressing here. Big head kick. He's hurting him bad, man. That right hook is nasty. 
Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Oh, wow, how about the roundhouse kick? Oh, man. Trying to inflict some damage here, but misses with the kick. Nice, good strikes. Keep going. Oh, nice head kick. Well, he's not a one-legged fighter yet, but that calf starting to show some signs of bruising. If he takes many more, he's not going to be able to move. There's a kick now to the body. That one blocked by Lee. Nice entry there and able to finish. Back to his patented kicks here, but just out of range. Oh, what a connection by him there. His opponent could be out of here soon, DC. He's almost done. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, you don't know whether to run, hide, grab, or wrestle. He's, a, he, I mean, he's confused. He's as confused as he was on his first test in elementary school. Five. When both are prepared, these are the types of fights that we expect. Well, he has landed a high volume of strikes in this round and really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. The striking has been on point every step of the way. Careful to not gas out, but you gotta like the output here down the stretch. Ian Machado Gary's cut on his nose is just pouring blood at this point. Oh, really good with the kick to the body. Any body kick may finish this fight. It does not have to be the front one up the middle. Oh, no pad on the foot. That's a solid kick right there. Oh, flying knee to the head. Oh, just misses with the kick. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. Some serious bruising going on in and around that right thigh. May want to check a leg kick or two. Trying to go to the body here. Unable to find the target. Well, lands a good series of kicks there, DC. It really didn't take him long to get a good beat on his opponent. He figured the timing, and now he's been driving kick after kick into his opponent. What a great fight. Damage doled out on both sides. Perhaps some bonus money coming the way of these two individuals at night time. 50K, baby. Somebody's getting paid. These two guys are doing a great job in a fight that is so competitive, that is so evenly matched. These two really will be proud of the effort that they have shown inside the octagon tonight. Lead kick is true there by Machado Gary. Oh, oh, he's in real trouble now. That blood becoming a real factor. Big right hand. Oh, huge left. Stuff the takedown, no problem. All right, now a little separation between the two fighters. Trying to do damage now with the kick. That's a miss. Lee's really bleeding heavily now. That cut is only getting worse by the minute. Thirty seconds in the round. Back kick there. Oh, nice check on the leg kick offering there. Ten seconds remaining in round four. Oh. Buzzer sounds for the end of round four. All right, well, if you like blood, and I do, this is the fight for you. Somehow we've made it to the stools, and both fighters are wearing it.
Yeah, I mean, the corner's going to have some work to do on that cut. He has been beat up in that round, but he has done his fair share of damage himself. This has been a very close fight. All right, let us re-rack some replays of the damage done in that round, see if we can isolate the strike that caused the cut. Yeah, a nasty cut opens up when he lands there. It's a beautiful shot that gets to the target. He has not been responsible defensively, and he's really paying for it because now he's dealing with that right, nasty see. cut. Breathe, relax, slow that heart rate down. It's okay. We expected this type of fight. We trained for this. We're bloody. We knew it was going to be... You ready to fight? Ready. Fifth and final round. Oh, looking to land the leg kick. That one checked. Oh, got to be careful taking too many of those leg kicks. Machado Gary's cut on his nose is just pouring blood at this point. You wonder if that's impacting his breathing by now. Oh, that right hand barely missed there. Lands a nice jab there. They're so evenly matched, and they're going tit for tat. All right, well, you can still attack the thigh, right? We talk so much about calf kicks, but that's been a pretty effective weapon for him here tonight. It's a traditional, it's a traditional leg kick. Just throwing your hip, bang, whipping it into the thigh. Beautifully done by this fighter. Right on the button. Just missed with the elbow there. All right, well, the local hospital might be busy later tonight. What an absolute war this has been. The cut men have done a pretty good job, but both guys are leaking in the face area. Yeah, they're working full, they're working full tonight. I mean, the cut men are having to try to piece these two together. Right on the right to the target. Let's see if his opponent can survive. I cannot believe he is still standing after taking that one. Oh, nice right hand. Another great shot to the body. They're really starting to connect at a high percentage now in the latter stages of this fight. Ian Machado Gary's really bleeding. Oh, he's hurt so bad. He's got to find safety. Find a way that you can recover. Oh, nice body shot. Oh, nice high kick. Slips to avoid the right. All right, late in the fight now, he needs a finish, or he's... And now a head kick to boot. Going back to his patented kicks here, but unable to find the target there. Just out of range with the big right hand. You don't want to eat too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Lee shot is blocked. Two minutes now to go in this one. Ian Machado Gary's really limping now, folks. Looks like the leg kicks are really starting to pay dividends for his opponent. Oh! Stuffs that takedown attempt without issue. And now some separation. Well, at this point, hard to blame him for headhunting, right? He has caused some significant swelling. Oh! Hurt him. Oh! Oh, my God! Massive left hand. Oh, sidekick. Well done. Oh, he blocked that punch. Well, it's a bloody Saturday, folks. He's really starting to leak out of that eye area, Danny. Well, he's leaking, John. He's wide open. The eyes are beat up. The guy's taking a beating, and the blood has to be affecting his vision at this point. Oh, nice. 
Ian Machado Gary's nose is absolutely mangled at this stage of the fight. I'm no doctor, but I feel pretty convicted in saying that thing is definitely broken, and we might get a ringside physician. Oh, a huge shot finds the target there. Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow-up attempt. The kill shot is what they call it to go and end the fight. Big right hand there. That's good defense to block that punch. Oh, big knee! He's got to try to finish here. Trying to go... The official decision is in. It resides with the venerable Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest 50 45. For the winner, by unanimous decision, and new undisputed UFC welterweight champion of the world, the future.